Tensions between the city of Palm Springs and College of the Desert continue to grow tonight. Both accuse the other of missteps in the development of a long-awaited West Valley campus. As News Channel 3's Miyoshi Price reports, the city is now suing the school. COD has continued a pattern of stonewalling, evasion, and delay. The city of Palm Springs is now suing College of the Desert, saying the school is not in compliance with the California Public Records Act. We've been trying since December 8th to get documents that show um, how the College of the Desert has changed their plans for a, a campus on the West Valley. Um, and we've been met with um, reluctance on their part. This is how the planned West Valley campus of the College of the Desert in Palm Springs looks now, the site of the old Palm Springs Mall. Currently, not a single part of the promised West Valley campus has ever broken ground. Eleven years later, COD officials have presented a dramatically reduced campus and now appear to ready to build a campus of just 114,000 square feet that would not open until 2027-28. The city says they want records to show how, when, and why the scope of the program changed. The city of Palm Springs finds this to drastically reduce plan to be shockingly unfair and unjust trying to get answers on what their thinking is and when they actually made these decisions to um, to not build the campus. Um, it was obvious a decision was made. It was who made the decision? When did they make it? Late Monday, College of the Desert shared a statement saying the school is operating in good faith, but has limited staff responding to dozens of documents, saying in part, through its lawsuit, the city suggests that the college has delayed responses to the city. This is simply not the case. The college has provided multiple responses, documents already. In Palm Springs, Miyoshi Price, News Channel 3. College of the Desert also went on the offensive against Palm Springs today about the original planned campus location on Tranview Road. COD plans to sell the land to a private developer and invest the proceeds into the Palm Springs campus project. In a statement telling News Channel 3, the city continues to inappropriately use this property sale as leverage to attempt to direct COD's decision making regarding the Palm Springs development project at the mall site. City officials maintain the Tranview land was only provided to the school for the purpose of building a campus. Right now at KESQ.com, you can see the lawsuit and the statements from today and new planning do uh, documents for the Palm Springs project. Plus, our Peter Dots in-depth interview with Mayor Middleton. The College of the Desert Board of Trustees will be talking about the progress this Thursday. We'll continue to provide updates on the air and online at KESQ.com.